We're making a right on a red. We are making a right on a red. This is the best thing ever. What's up everybody? My name is Dietrich and today I am going to show you how full self-driving works. I am in a Tesla Model Y Performance 2024 model that has the full self-driving active. So to use full self-driving, the first thing you need to do is set a destination in the navigation system. So get directions to Dave & Buster's in Torrance. And it's thinking about it. And now it has gotten the directions. So now that the navigation system has the directions, I just bump down on the stock. And instead of putting it in drive, I pushed it down towards the little speedometer cruise control looking icon. And now my hands are off the wheel and the full self driving is active. Okay, green light. Here we go. She's turning the wheel on her own, my friends. We're not gonna hit the Toyota RAV4. We are in the lane. And would you look at that? No hands on the wheel, no feet on the pedals. We are self-driving. It wanted me to apply slight force to the steering wheel right there, which I did. It is still your responsibility to pay attention to the road, be ready to intervene if the car does something stupid, which it may very well. But right now, we are driving. Hands off the wheel, feet off the pedals. We are living the dream. It's the future. We are living in the future. I'll tell you how I know. I read it in the paper 15 years ago. We're all driving rocket ships and talking with our minds. We're wearing turquoise jewelry and standing in soup lines apply turning force to the wheel. Of course, it goes without saying that, again, you're in control. Well, no, you're not. I mean, you should always pay attention. This is not, see what this guy does. He's gonna let us go, thank you. You should always be keeping an eye on things because the car may do an imperfect job. You know, this is not meant to just set it and then shoot heroin and pass out and wake up at home. That's not what you wanna do. Wait till you get home to to do any illicit narcotics now i was playing around with this the other day and it seemed to apply the turn si there it goes it turned on its own turn signal and it's changing lanes folks Woo! apply slight force to the steering wheel it just kind of seems to want to make sure that you're still paying attention and it brings itself to a complete stop. I have made a lot of videos about adaptive cruise control, and um, this is obviously head and shoulders above most of those systems because this thing does a lot more. But this it's almost like adaptive cruise is more of a driver aid. I don't know if I would use this if I owned one of these cars. And eh, I probably would, who am I kidding? Modern conveniences will make us all lazy. Look at it, creeping forward. Keeping up with traffic. Green lights. Green lights. And we're moving forward. Apply slight force to the steering wheel. Oh! Okay, so what just happened there was I apply it the, it gave me a little message telling me to apply slight force to the steering wheel and I applied a little too much force so that it like I affected the steering and then it cancels the self-driving so then you have to bump the stick down again. I will say like the ease of use of this system is very very good. It is just a little bit wonky and confusing for people. Well, for me anyway, some you people watching may be much smarter than I am and have this all figured out, although you're probably not, honestly. Um, not that you're stupid, just that I'm very smart and I've used a lot of these systems. But what you have to understand is you may need to intervene at any time. 
wonder if I should cut that out or leave it in. Now nah, I'll leave it in. What the hell? This is so wild. Man, I wish my grandma was here. Ah. My grandma died about a year and a half ago, and she was 93, and she was amazing. But I remember this was a few years back. I had I had driven a Model 3. No, it was a Model Y, and it was in 2021. And I told her about it on the phone and about how the car was all electric. And this was like a new concept to her. Oh, there we go. We're signaling. Oh, oh. Now look at that. It tried to it tried to do the right thing in the lanes even though so what I what I noticed it was doing was it was following. Okay, let's see what it does here. Okay, it's going to yield for the yellow. Oh. Okay, we're going to come to a stop. That's fine. No problem. So, I told my grandma about this Tesla and that it's an all electric car and she was like, "What? You don't have to go to the ga Oh. We're making a right on a red. We are making a right on a red. This is the best thing ever." She was very fascinated with the fact that you didn't have to go to the gas station because she was a child of the Great Depression, so not having to pay for gas, I think, was very enticing to her on, like, a an emotional level. And I never did... I was going to, like, rent a Tesla up there and show it to her and stuff, and I never did. Fuck. Oh, well. Nani, I hope you can watch me now because, look it, I am driving with no hands on the steering wheel. She would hate this. She would be like, no, put your hands on the wheel. Oh, what a machine. The Tesla Model Y Performance. There's different settings, too. I think this one's set to be, like, the most aggressive driving um, because the guy that owns it, that's his style, and it's his car, and I'm not going to bother to change the settings because I don't really care. I'm just doing this to kind of show everybody how it works. But that was pretty rad that it made a right on a red. That was, that was cool. Let's see what it does now. We got an... Ipanema Sand Range Rover making a U-turn. Thing looks like it's seen better days. Okay, green light. Okay, it wanted me to apply slight force, so I did that. Now we need to go to the unnamed road in four tenths of a mile. There it goes. We're signaling. We're changing lanes. I have my hand on my crotch, but I'm not doing anything untoward okay that red car made me a little nervous I was getting ready to react if he did something stupid okay where are you doing Tesla oh see it didn't know where it wanted to go there it was thinking to go there but it wants to keep going straight which is the right way to go that's funny it's like <laughs> it's not always super duper confident That person in a Kia Soul just made an interesting maneuver there. Oh, we got a blink. We're going into a parking lot. Oh, look it. It wants to. Now, all right, now I got to intervene. It wanted to go into the park. <laughs> okay. All right. Turn your blinker off. Now, let's see if we can have you do it again. That's so funny. All right. Let's see if it goes in here. So I took control briefly because it was thinking to turn into those orange barriers. And now I just bumped the uh, stock to put it back into full self-drive. So we're full self-driving again. Now let's see where it goes. This is like one of those dying malls. But the company that I work for... Okay, don't hit these women, please. That would be very bad. It sees them. You can see that it sees the people. So it knows that they're there. It shows their little stick figures walking on the screen. Okay, that was a horrible turn. We are completely in the other lane. This is a parking lot, but still, come on. You can do better than that. I have, I have faith in you. All right, we're following the road. Okay. Again, we're kind of in the middle of the yellow line. Okay, now you don't know where... Oh, are you looking for a parking... Autopilot navigation complete. You're on your own from here, sucker. Oh, and it did. It. I told it to take me to Dave & Buster's, and look. 
Looky, 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 we are at the Dave and Buster's. That's so funny. I'm actually headed to the parking garage right behind the Dave and Buster's to film a review on this thing. So you can find a link to that in the description. I hope you found my demonstration of autopilot slash being slightly megalomaniacal slash uh, feeling some sadness that my grandmother's no longer here and I never did show her a Tesla while she was alive entertaining. If you did, please like my video, subscribe to my channel and have a great day. And if you didn't, then just subscribe to my channel. Don't do the other stuff, but subscribe. It's free, don't worry about it, it's fine. Bye-bye.